Hey everybody, this is Rob Gothier, the ET Whisperer. How are you guys doing today? I hope everyone's doing well. I wanted to send my appreciation and love for all of the support we've been getting in the videos recently. Uh, comments, love, support, suggestions, everything you guys share is definitely uh, well received and well appreciated. I wanted to come in tonight to share with you really quickly a Patreon clip. We have two different types of Patreon, uh, two different ones each month. One of them is a in-depth poll where people suggest ideas. Uh, we vote for those ideas and then the winner gets channeled on in depth for 60 to 90 minutes. And the second of the month is the Q&A where people send in one question each. They get put into a pile, everyone chooses, and then the people who get drawn get their questions answered. Tonight, uh, we just did one of those and there were some amazing topics. The one topic we're going to choose tonight is something about the afterlife, and it came through in a question of a personal experience, and we wanted to share that with you really, really quickly. Also, you guys uh, who want to know about what's going on with E.T. Whisper and all the stuff that we're doing, you can go to the end of this video after the channeling is over, and we'll share a bunch of stuff there with you guys. Love you guys. Thanks so much for being a part of our E.T. Whisper community. Love you guys, and we'll see you on the other side. No. He says, yes, yeah, so I was driving, and I saw a man that I thought was dead in his car. So I turned around to check on him, and when I did, this very creepy lady with entirely black or no eyes pulled up and got out of her car and stared me down. Uh, then, as I was driving away, she followed me for quite some time, and I got a major and very sudden nosebleed, which I never get. Yes, when you are experiencing this energy, you are experiencing that similar threshold that other humans are going through at this time. Now that humans have entered this fourth density level of their own consciousness, because you have been working on expanding the mind, the visual inner technology, and because you have desired to see the higher realms of the universal energy, you are starting to break through the area of consciousness that is between the third and fourth density. Now, this is a difficult concept for many humans to understand in a very full way, but many years before, as humans would die, they are going from that level of third density and living strictly and only in that third density so after they are dying their physical body is left behind they are going between the level of third and fourth density energies but at the time of 2003 all of the way to your now moment because you started transitioning to that level of fourth density and last year as the last year of that transition phase now all entities after they leave their body were going somewhere between the higher levels of third density if you call them each level that gives an assessment of one tenth of a percentage, then one energy that you could say is most humans in 1980 of your years were going in to density 3.2 or 3.3 after death. But as you approach the 2000s, you are going to 3.5 or 3.6. And as you approach into that third to fourth density level of exchange, 3.8 and 3.9. And now after you have crossed that threshold and the 18 year cycle of energy, they are going between density 4.1 and 4.15.
So now you are starting to see all of the layers that once you were not able to perceive because you are going above that level. So many of these entities who have suffered outside of their bodies and continue to hold deeply to the earth energy, obsessing over the earth energy, are in those layers of consciousness and what you are seeing is not simple transition of one entity that you crossed about and another that co-created with you but what you are seeing is an entire system starting to transition many of the entities that past in that timeline or in the time region of the 1980s are now starting to realize that they are seeing more humans and more humans are seeing them. So now it is up to them to either reincarnate or go into that higher dimensional level of energy, but either will require work, will require effort, and some of these humans that are passed onward are extremely upset at humans who can see them because in their own assessment it is the humans who are still living that are able to see them that are forcing the changes upon them and how they operate and work as well. The nosebleed that comes is one from your own change of the third eye because your third eye shifts so drastically and has opened so greatly in the last four years, the energy of the bleeding nose that comes into that experience is simply your physical body being affected by the energetic center in the third eye, and the drastic opening of that energy has created that experience. Even the host has gone through these nosebleeds in the last several months as well. All right, everybody, thank you so much for checking that out. Our Patreon is growing, and we want it to grow to an amount where we can do it once per week instead of twice a month. That's the in-depth poll where everyone puts a suggestion. Every single suggestion gets put into a poll, and those polls get voted on. The winner gets that, like I explained earlier, and also the Q&A. Everyone sends in a question, and your questions get the opportunity to be answered. But you get two channelings a month, and we're trying to get that up to four. If we get enough people there, we would uh, expand out to four times per month once a week which would be really great and amazing uh the other thing that we're trying to do uh, is get people over to our discord our discord has grown to 250 people 24 hours around the clock we have people from all over the world hanging out there talking about spirituality talking about everything under the sun and we have different parts of the server for different subjects and topics you can drop some memes you can talk about video games you can talk about your favorite breakfast burrito doesn't matter uh, a community that's all there just based around the channeling community especially the et whisper channeling community it's free it doesn't cost a penny really would love to see uh, those of you who want to be more a part of our community join there we also also want to uh, share that we're still doing our channeling classes we did not do one this month but we are going back to that unfortunately the venue we were using to collect payments hasn't paid us in the last two months so we're not going to do any more things through them uh, we've lost our customer support through them uh, I think that they're going to get ready to go out of business and they'll probably end up taking our money with us the last two months I did for free uh, which is unfortunate but it is what it is live and learn uh, so we're gonna try to find a way to implement that to our website and hopefully at the end of this week we'll have that done uh, and also personal sessions are still available we did make a huge change instead of five people in our group sessions at 20 minutes each we've now shut it down to four people each getting 30 minutes people were saying 20 minutes is not enough and we listen to what you guys say so we ended up just cutting it down to four people 30 minutes each and actually at the same price our sessions were for 30 minutes before the only difference is it's in a group session uh, the other person personal session with private one-on-one -on -one sessions is still available and that's the most used uh, service out of all of them that we offer but we will be offering some more soon. We also hope to get our, our uh, radio network the Enlightenment Evolution Network up and running by this upcoming month. Uh, Kalina has spent a lot on equipment for our studio and hopefully we'll be able to get that done. So I just want to let you guys know your support is invaluable to us. We love you with all of our hearts. Thank you so 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 much for being a part of a experience we're hoping that whether you've spent a penny with us or not you're still gaining something from being around in our perspective 
If you've gained anything on your journey by spending time with us, then it's worth our time and your time too. And it doesn't matter if you never buy a session, you don't join Patreon, if you're only at our Discord or YouTube or Facebook or wherever, uh, Twitter, Instagram, then you can be there and that's perfect. As long as you're getting something from what we're doing, we're excited to keep doing it. Love you guys so, so much. We appreciate everything you guys have done to help support us and send us love uh, through all of our family things that we've gone through and continue to go through. And we just really want to make sure you guys know how important you are to us. We love you guys so, so much. I hope you enjoyed this channeling and we'll see you on the other side.